Welcome to this video guys. In this video, I'll show you how you can connect to MongoDB server from VS Code and how you can check if MongoDB server is running or not. We will also create a collection and view the collection in MongoDB server. So let's get started. First of all, go to extensions here and type MongoDB and you will see this MongoDB for VS Code. This is from MongoDB itself. Don't install this one, install the one that is from MongoDB itself and click on install. Once the installation is complete, you will see this icon here that says MongoDB. Now here, you can add a connection. But first, we need to ensure that MongoDB server is running in your system. To check if MongoDB server is running or not, press your Windows key and type services. Click on this services. And now scroll down till you see MongoDB server and the status here is running. If it is not running in your case, just right click on it and click on start here and your service will be running. Once the MongoDB server is running, click on add connection and here you get two options, connection string and connection settings. So connection string is something like this. It is in this format, username, password, at the rate cluster. So this is quite long. What we will do is we will use connection settings. So click on open form. And here, this is the URI of our MongoDB server. This is the port MongoDB server is running on. So this is the default MongoDB URI. If you have not changed anything, it will look the same in your case too. If you have changed the port, enter the port number here. And if your MongoDB is running not on your local machine, but on some other server, enter that server's domain name or IP address here. Now, if you have set a username and password, click on advanced settings and enter the username and password on authentication. So you have the field to add username, password, and authentication database, but I have not set any of these, so I'll not enter this. So once you are done, just click on save and connect. As you can see, we have connected to the MongoDB server and we can see the existing databases or collections here. So now I'll close this. To see what data you have, you can just open a database and this is a collection. You can right click on it and click on view documents. So we are seeing the data inside our sales collection. Now you can click on this create new playground. Here you can run queries and do all this stuff. So as you can see, we are just selecting a database. We are inserting a few documents. And if I run this, you'll get asked this confirmation. Just click on yes. And we have now successfully run these queries. So to see the result, what you can do is just right click on this and refresh. And as you can see, a test is created and we have the sales collection inside test. If I right click and click on view documents, whatever we have inserted here will be visible here. Okay, so this is how you can connect to a MongoDB server, how you can create a playground, run queries and view the data inside a database. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.